Welcome back to our Road to Nebula series here on BO6 Zombies. And today I'm going to pick what weapon we're doing and that's the new SOG SMG. And I want to go ahead and try this weapon out akimbo, but here's the rest of the attachments we're going to be using for it. Now, before we head into the game, I have some bad news. All of the XP tokens that carried over from MW2 and 3 have been removed from BO6, but I have a solution. So if you head on over to the COD HQ and you open up a war zone over here, and then once you're in, you just have to select a playlist like plunder, and then you'll see your XP thing down here and you'll have all of your carryover tokens here in the should still work in bo6 and you can see right here now that we're loaded back into bo6 and in the zombies menu all of our xps there so i've been really enjoying season one so far and it's just really disappointing to see that they took all that good grace that they gained with the community and just threw it away by completely removing all those double xp tokens but i'm trying to try not to focus on that right now let's focus more on these new smgs i use this a bit as the single smg for a while and it was going pretty all right it's not like a groundbreaking smg MG, but maybe here with akimbo we can get some more stuff done and we're only on our second generator here and i'm already basically out of ammo i got 12 and 11 bullets in each gun so let's go ahead and buy some but i'm hoping that these can actually do some decent damage on a high round because it seems like a lot of the weapons they've added into this game cannot compete past round 30 and that's even after they went through and they buffed a few things they buffed the he1 launcher and they said that they buffed the ars or at least adjusted them because they got nerfed from the multiplayer update that extended into zombies unintentionally. And apparently with the last update, it just reverted the damage that they just gave it. So as of right now, the ARs are even worse than before. But maybe since we got two guns, we might be able to do double the damage. But from my experience in previous COD games, it doesn't seem to work like that. But the nice thing about an akimbo attachment in this game, or at least for these SMGs specifically, is that it doesn't take over the firing mode for the weapon, which I was scared of. Because basically every single weapon that i've ran in zombies has had the rapid fire attachment on them but luckily they're not going to take it out on us and we can have the akimbo attachment and rapid fire at the same time and let's see if it helps but i did get a decent amount of the camos on this done after we were messing around on directed mode and then we found out about the whole you know staying on whatever round and grinding camos out there i have a decent amount of our critical kills done i still need to get a few more but after i'm done with the crits we need to get point blank kills in zombies which is a little weird and we also need to get kills with dead wire on these but what i'm seeing so far is that we've ran out of ammo at least three times and it's only round five so pack a punching is gonna be our top priority so speaking of pack a punch let's turn this bad boy on and let's be on the lookout for any chests underwater here. But give me a pack crystal right here. Nope. Oh, but we do have fish over here. I forgot about this. Recently, a side Easter egg was discovered to get perkaholic and you just got to blow up 50 fish. So maybe we try to do that today because apparently the game doesn't like dropping perkaholics at all. I think I have maybe like two perkaholics total throughout this entire game. But I don't know if our impact grenade really did anything to those fish. I think they're completely fine, right? Oh no, they're dead as hell. And we have enough to pack a punch, but I'm gonna gamble here. Hold on. Speaking of gambling, here you go, fish. What does that have to do with gambling, you might ask? No idea. But I'm gonna gamble on us actually getting a pack a punch crystal from one of these chests that are in the water. I wanna go ahead and save as much money and salvage as we can, because we're also gonna get a legendary Aether tool out of one of these. I'm manifesting it right now. So help me out here, chest. Come on. Oh, and here comes the fun police. The giant phallic monster wants to come and stop us from getting our pack crystal, but it ain't happening. Oh, it might be happening. It's right there. All right, we're, we're gonna have to come back to this. To the island we go. Nice try, big shit cloud. Oh, wait. Maybe the game's gonna prove me wrong. Give me Perkaholic right now. Nope, cash back. Not even close. Is there any chests around the shore here? There's fish, but I don't have a nade. Do you have a nade for me in here? No, it's all the same stuff in these chests. Just salvage and, and like a little bit of essence. Back on our treasure hunt. Oh, speaking of treasure, give me the Audemars Piguet. And what kind of booty do we got hanging out on this island? Nothing. Lame. I guess today's just garbage RNG day. All right, well, we got extremely unlucky. We're going to have to go pack a punch. Give me that. And let's go ahead and move on up. And now they're pack a punch. They have 91 bullets in the mag and 540 in reserve. That does not seem like a whole lot for two weapons. I feel like we're going to be running out of ammo quite a bit. Can we hit the basketball at these? Is it even possible with how crazy the spread is on this? I don't think so. Oh, but we got our crits done. Let's go. What just happened right there? I'm confused. Why did a nuke go off? Did I just land on a nuke and not see it? But it would have said kaboom. Oh no, we did hit the basketball somehow. Holy shit. That actually just saved my life. I thought the game was being nice to us since we just unlocked a, a camo or something. 
I was so confused. That was got to be the most clutch three I've ever hit. And we're out of ammo yet again, but we have just enough to get packed too. And actually, since we have the Mastercraft on these, does it still keep the inspect? No, I think it's just the default inspect for it, akimbo. What a ripoff. And actually, I'm going to commit to not buying any perks until we can complete the perkaholic Easter egg. We just got to grab every nade we find and just obliterate these fish with them. Did that make it far enough? God damn it. We cooked it a little too long. What are we getting for this trial? Death from below? Lame. Oh, already done. Ooh, stamina up. Gimme. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. Why are you oh deering? I just made Maxis nut. Oh shit. Well, there goes stamina up. We got slapped hard. Now we gotta buy a self revive this early into the game. And can I afford any nades? The cheapest one is just a normal one. So we'll grab that. Let's terrorize some fish. I think I might break my own rule about not buying perks and get melee macchiato so we can go ahead and start up our uh, little pirate side Easter egg. I feel like melee macchiato don't even count. It ain't even gonna help us. What's up, buddy? Here's our watch. And let's also start this trial. Oh, hip fire, easy. That's what we're looking for. There we go. What you got for us? Jug. Thank you. Any fish hiding over here, though? Oh, there's an amalgamation. Shit. Ooh, we're actually kind of tearing through his health. Ooh. And that's without any dead shot. So we're not getting that extra crit bonus, but we do have the ammo type that he's weakest to. Holy shit. We actually might go down here. Did we kill him? Is he gone? Is he dead? Oh, there he is. There's our boy. Now he's dead. In a nuke? Might as well give me that. Because I'm after the fish. Eat this. Bastards. Oh, we got our whisper camel. That looks beautiful. I'm pretty sure that's our dead wire kills, right? Because I don't think I've gotten that many point blanks. And why are these zombies only dropping stims? I need nades. Maybe the sand trial right here is going to be use equipment. That'd be very convenient. Oh, it's field upgrade. You know what? That, that works for us too. As long as somebody's got some ammo that I can use. Because we are out of it. Um, We're going to have to go to the next island to get some ammo because they removed the ammo box that was right there by dead shot for whatever reason give me that let's train for a second and now let's complete the trial a thermal grenade will that even work i oh, we have a normal nade and another stim what's up with stims today i've never seen so many and i don't know what our fish kill counts at but i think we need like what 55 or 50 something like that i would think we're maybe at like 10. Ooh, purple aether tool, gimme. And we got some scrap from there. Honestly, I won't feel bad about crafting some nades. Let's go do that. So these are the cheapest. We will get five of them. Nope, we can only craft one. Forgot there was an awesome bug going on right now where you can only get one lethal from the crafting table. But it still took all my salvage. So that's sick. We're just gonna have to scavenge this whole game, apparently. But what if I've been lied to and this perkaholic doesn't exist? Oh, wait, we did get a perk. Okay, you just gotta start putting doubt on it and the game's gonna prove you wrong. That's the rules. Holy shit. If this isn't all of our point blanks, I don't even know how we're gonna get them. Because that was a fat chunk. Had to be. Oh fuck, I forgot about that already. Nice. Just eight more salvage. You believe this, Mangler? Oh, shit. Give me pack three. And I have gotten completely sidetracked from not only grinding camos. Well, actually, I think we're probably doing a good job on those. But we haven't gone and done our pirate quest or our Easter egg quest. Perkaholic is priority number one right now. Bye-bye, Mangler. Ooh, a legendary key. What are we getting with this legendary key? Anything useful? Oh, perk. Let's get a legendary on these. So now we are fully maxed out on them. What? Did I just break the amalgamation's arm right there? That's kind of crazy. I've never seen that before. That was a perfectly timed frenzied. And now it's about to be a perfectly timed camo. Go ahead. Hand it over. Absolutely just obliterated all these guys. And we have two mollies, so it's probably best that we go ahead and try to go do the pirate thing. All right, you're first, buddy. Night, night. Give me that. Next. Bye, bye, buddy. Oh, shit, I'm out of ammo. Hold on. You know where the ammo is on this island, sir? Oh, here it is. All right. Bye, bye. 
Any fish hanging out while we got a nade on us? Come here, fishy, fishy, fishy. We got some right here. We're gonna blow up our boat, probably. Nope. Still no perkaholic. We are completely devastating this ecosystem and not even getting any rewards for it. Oh, we got dead shot out of a dig spot. Holy shit. We might just get all of our perks by accident before we can even get them all from this. Oh, and the zombie blocked my thermal grenade. Actually, did that still work? No, it's too far away. You guys got any more of those just hanging around over here? Oh, you do actually. Thank you. Okay, last dude. Enjoy. Come here, buddy boy. Let's put you down. There you go. Let's return our last coin. What do you got for us? Put yap it and give me stuff. Thank you. Ooh. Have I not used any of these yet? The PP91... Wait, what? That looks so different from when I used it. Why does it have a mag? It's supposed to be like the bison. I guess I used a 9mm. Or at least have it with me. Let's throw a quick monkey bomb. I will get all up in these zombies' faces. We can knock out some point blanks if we still need them. And then activate our frenzied and do the same. Because I don't think we still need this camo. There's no way, right? We gotta be onto our gold challenge by now. Oh, there it is. Perfect. Lime wave. Definitely looks like lime wire. And I'm starting to feel like we're not gonna get this perkaholic thing done until like round 90. How many fish do I gotta take out? There's no speed calls really making this difficult right now. Same with no stamina up. This is dog shit. But we can spend some of the points we saved on that tier 3 armor. And let's see if there's any fishies over by the shore. Yep. Here we go. Ooh, a pack crystal. Guess we'll get it on this. Oh, I should have went and grabbed the pistol from spawn. Now we don't have to keep getting nades. Let's go do that. I wish I would, like, think more often. It'd be sweet. But we will get it right after we hold this location. And maybe we can use these trial zombies to get gold done. If we can do enough damage to take them out. Because this is a fat chunk of zombies. We're kind of slaying right now. Come on. Show me gold. That was way more than 15 zombies rapidly right there. What if we cheese it? Let's do this. Activate it. And light them up for as long as the trial's still going. Please give me gold. Just a little bit. Slight amount of gold. No? Alright. Oh no, there it is. Let's go. Beautiful. We're all out of camos to get, but I'm still going until I get Perkaholic. Now we just need this wall by here. Now we gotta make a mad dash for the pack punch machine. There we go. This is explosive, right? Yep. Now let's see if this will even work. Where are some fish? Here we go. That didn't even blow up, did it? Oh, there we go. All right, let's get a boat. And let's go fishing. Jeez, who fucking parked here? Like an asshole. Now, I know I'm probably doing this, like, extremely inefficiently, but is there a way to get this done before, like, we're close to round 30? Because we would already have all of our perks by now if I just wouldn't bought them. And does this give it to every player in the game or just the player that activates it? Because I can see that being useful for, like, your whole team goes down or something. You clutch a little side easter egg. Another pack crystal. We're getting there. It feels like the more fish we kill, the better loot's dropping from their corpses. Okay, I say that and then we just get ammo. That's more than what zombies drop. At least ammo-wise. Oh, did we just get it? I think we did. Right? That's every perk? That was uneventful. I thought there'd be like a sound or something. I just shot a fish from the boat. And all of a sudden we had everything. All right, penis monster. You made your point. But I'm the real winner here. All right, well, I don't feel like waiting until X-Fill. Let's hit one more gobble gum. And then I'm going to go do my last stand. What we got? Cash back. Perfect. Just the thing we need for this gun. Let's call our elevator back up and try to survive over here. We'll see if we can make it. So far, so good. There's a decoy. Go chase it. Stay the hell away from me. And if we can just... Oh, I was about to say, if we can just make it to a frenzy, we might be okay. And another decoy on the ground. Actually, if we can survive one whole round here, I'll go and hit up the X-Fill. And then activate frenzied while we're low on ammo. We're doing it. We're living. We are about to be out of ammo, though. 
Oh, actually, that Mangler came in clutch. Max armor, holy shit. All that recoil hit at once. And there we go. It actually just survived for now. I don't have ammo though. Can I get out of here, guys? What about if I nade? You guys like that? They love that. These zombies love nades. We're gonna have to punch our way out. Oh, Dying Wish saved us? And a tomahawk to end it. Alright, I guess I'll exfil. Fine game. You convinced me. One more gobble gum for the road. Ooh, free fire? This is actually perfect. Now let's skedaddle. Alright, let's try out this free fire. Our last hurrah. Let me take out all 45 zombies here. Without having to use our mutant injector. Oh shit, we're already getting surrounded. No amalgams, really? You're not going to send your heavy hitters at us? Shit, yeah, it looks like we're going to survive this. These guys don't stand a chance if I can just constantly fire. Yeah, it's over for you. Oh shit, there's an amalgam. Okay, all right. I got to stop talking shit because they immediately talk it right back. Oh, let me get this while we're on the ground. This is actually clutch as hell. I should have on the uh, quick revive perk. That's not Dying Wish. That way I can get myself back up with the explosive pistol. That'd be nice. But back to free fire. It's almost out though. Let's focus on the amalgam. Oh, now it's gone. Okay. Can we kill him with the rest of this mag? Oh, he might get us back. Oh shit. Reload. There you go. Woo. Really made it through. Get me out of here. Well, here's what our SOGs look like in game with Mystic Gold on our Mastercraft version of it. And it don't look too bad. I like how the camos kind of mesh more with the blueprints in this game before it kind of just like laid it over top. But it looks like it actually takes care of like the primary and secondary colors of it. And then this is our Mastercraft with the Whisper camo on it. I really like this Whisper camo and we actually get to see the animation on it. Not bad and it just gets to fire a little cannonball there at the end as well. I really like this camo. The special camos in this game have been really nice. And here is our default Sog My Nuts with the Mystic Gold camo on them. I can't believe it took me this long to hit a Sog My Nuts, but you know what? I don't care. We, we got the camo done and that's what matters. Anyways, I'm going to go ahead and get out of here. Thank you guys for watching. I truly appreciate all your love and support and I will see you in the next one. Later.